friend died three years ago, died of an acute illness. Roy's heart was once again shattered. He asked his daughter to take him to the cemetery. He never expected to see her again. It's like this. Roy tries his best to adapt to his life now, taking care of his daughter every day, taking his daughter to school. At the same time he keeps looking around the house for traces of his life over the last 10 years. He finds a trophy in a box, the playwriting competition that he had been thinking about for so long. He had finally won the prize. His dream had come true, but his heart was still empty. He couldn't wait to see his work, turning on the player, spinning around and around. The image of his girlfriend appears on the screen, so she's the lead actress in the film. Looking at his girlfriend, who was still young, Roy couldn't contain himself. He was desperately trying to remember what had happened in the last 10 years, but after a long time of thinking, he still couldn't remember anything. Roy was left with tears of regret. The film was finished, his eyes suddenly went black. When Roy came to his senses again, to find himself in a hospital recliner, the doctor said that the future experience this drug has given you, it must have left something in your heart. Oh my god, it was just a dream. Roy came home, to find his girlfriend still sitting in the room, both of them looking young. Roy said let's talk, plan our future. His girlfriend happily says yes. What a dream. It woke up Roy who had been in a daze. He was no longer running away from reality. Even if he failed over and over again, it's only meaningful if you've experienced it.